Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Huey. Today's video is going to be a generalized love reading for the Zodiac Cancer. So before we begin, this is a generalized love reading, so it will not resonate with everyone, so be sure to check out your rising sign, your moon sign, and also your Venus sign to see if those resonate. Okay, so the tarot deck I will be using for this reading is a Universal Way tarot deck. And then for my oracle card reading, I will be using the Whispers of Love by Angela Hartfield and artwork by Josephine Wall. Alright you guys, so before we begin, I would like to do a prayer to cleanse the area. Dear Archangel Raphael, please come forth, protect me, guide me, open up my third eye so that I can receive beautiful information for the Zodiac Cancer. Thank you so much Archangel Raphael. Okay you guys, let's begin. Okay, I feel the energy is strongest right here. And I will be doing the Celtic Cross Spread. Alright, let's begin. Okay, so Cancer, right now I see that you are, you know, stable. You are patient and you are looking forward to see what's coming to you. You're open-minded right now and you're very welcoming. So this is very, very beautiful. So if you are in a relationship, I see like, you know, you are um, definitely um, very patient with your partner and you are, you know, you're compromising. That's really good. And if you are looking for a relationship, you are just waiting for the right partner. You know, you are not really um, like, out to get them right now. You're just patiently waiting for them to come to you. So this is great. You know, you guys are laying low, you guys are optimistic, and you guys are waiting for beautiful things to come to you. Alright, so let's see what's standing in front of you. Choices. You guys are going to have to make a choice soon. It's going to be a really hard choice, and you feel like you will be blinded by it. But, um, yeah, so as of right now, I don't really have enough information to see, you know, what will be the outcome of these choices, so let's move on. But definitely, I know there's going to be a hard, difficult decision coming your way soon. Okay, so your environment right here, you are scared right here. Maybe about the choice that you are going to make. As you can see, the swords are around this person, and this person is also blindfolded as well. But... Rest assured, if you move forward, if you just move forward from that fear, you will succeed. So this card is telling me that you will succeed if you face your fear. So if you choose a decision that you fear the most, I think that will be a really better turnout for you, okay? Alright, so let's see, in your past, in your past, you have won a lot. You know, you have defeated a lot of, you know, um, you know, a lot of battles, and you got what you wanted. You fought for it, and you have succeeded. So this is really good right here. I see a lot of swords right here, so I see a lot of air signs right here. So you are probably, um, you know, are surrounded by either um, Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra that is affecting your decision making right here. Okay, so let's see what you're thinking about. You may think about giving up. Don't give up. Oh my goodness. You're thinking about giving up and leaving all your emotions aside. Please don't do that. Please do not give up. Please move forward and please learn from it. But also take what you deserve and take what you will accomplish, okay? So never give up, Cancer. Never. Alright, so let's see what's standing in front of you, not standing in front of you, um, tentatively in the future. I see tentatively in the future your cups are going to flow out. 
So that's telling me that, you know, you may lose some emotional interest if you are, you know, dating someone or if you are pursuing someone. So, um, I see this is only tentatively, but uh, if you walk away, of course your cup is going to, you know, flow out. Stay, and this will be fulfilled again, okay, Cancer? So as I see right here, I see some fear, I see choices that you had to make you know, in front of you, but if you choose the one that scares you the most, that will be the one that will grow you the most, and also grow you into a better person. Use the confidence that you have gotten in the past right here to boost your morale, because you will get it. Don't give up. You're thinking about giving up right now. Don't give up on what you're doing. Keep on pushing forward, and then, if you do push forward, this card will turn right side up and your future will be fulfilled in the month of April. Alright? So, Cancer, definitely promise me, don't give up and your life will become so much better. Alright, Cancer, so let's see what the universe have in store for you. Oh, okay, well this card right here just wants to pop up, so we will leave that there. So I see the energy is strongest right here. Okay. Show simple acts of kindness. A simple act of kindness can energize you and bring happiness to those around you. So definitely be considerate about each other and also act kind, right here, temperance, right here, temperance. Definitely act kind and patient and compromise for everyone that is around you because that will give you joy and that will give you love and that will also bring happiness to you and the person that's in your surroundings, okay? Next card. Consider your foundation. You are being asked to look at how committed you are to love. So definitely, wherever that you're at, I would say look at what you need to do so you can improve your love. Like, build that foundation, build that ground, and ground yourself in it so you will have a place to come home and stay and re-energize your love right here. So this is telling me right here that you need to be a little bit more grounded. Right now you're kind of flowing everywhere, you're kind of thinking everywhere, and you're about to lose your, you know, your emotion right here. So stay grounded so you can stay where you are so you don't give up. This card is telling me that you should not give up, you should be grounded, and so your um, emotions can stay fulfilled and not overflow, okay? Okay, next card. Back to what you love. Your current situation is giving you an opportunity to reevaluate what you want. So as of right now, think what you want in life. Think what you want to do, think what you want to uh, accomplish so that you can bring the love into your life again. This card right here. Choices that you are going to make. Bring back what you love. Pick the right choice, pick the one that you love, and pick the one that will challenge you the most, okay? Because that will give you joy and love in your life. Okay, so the last card. Be willing to express love. When we express love, we begin to receive more love. So, say it out loud. Say that you love someone. Say that you love some things. It could be a love of a partner. It can be a love of a, you know, a um, relationship, a friendship, family. Just say it out loud. You love. And love will come to you. Alright, Cancer, so this is a really beautiful reading right here. I hope you guys like it. So if you guys like it, please give me a thumbs up. And also subscribe for more videos. So until next time, bye!